variation of one ten thousandth of an inch cannot escape the scrutiny of the inspector. The results of this gauging in nine sizes are conveyed by telewriter to the piston inspector. Graded pistons are selected to fit each engine ready for its arrival on the assembling line. And so continues this progress. See how they run. Note how they pull. An exhaustive test of each engine for power, output and speed. The hum of 40 engines under test. wheel and bevel pinion run in together carrying their wedding lines upon them. Fate and the axle assemblers then decree that they must work together forever. The gauge determines mesh to within one thousandth part of an inch. are tested by sound. The tester listens. The most exacting music critic listens no more intently nor detects with greater certainty a fault in their movement. this mighty organization, all work, every operation, however small or large, 
must proceed to a common beat. This is the culmination of a vast system of production. From all points in orderly sequence, parts converge on the assembling line. One car every three minutes is the output. One car every three minutes of the working day. The seven assembling line on which at the end of 1931, over 150,000 Austin 7s had been assembled. 